Hello everybody, welcome back. It is Sunday the 18th of Feb and I am on Chapel Street as you can see and I am here to bring you guys an update on the Flatpool Central development. It's a nice quiet Sunday morning. I'm on my way to work so we can walk around this whole thing and take a good old look. So yep, let's go. I really don't think there's going to be a lot of outward change, noticeable outward change what we can see now because pretty much the outward structure of this car park building has been more or less finished for quite some time now. So really now it's just going to be the inside that's going to be completed and also the pavement and roads and just surround surrounding stuff but we're going to walk around anyway and take a good old look so yeah let's get back on to Chapel Street we've got this wider pavement to walk in now can peek through there you can see that little road runs there along the back the railings up and everything just going to peek through all of the bits of fence you can see there all the ground and the markings are in the road markings are in so this side looks pretty much almost finished look you can see there there's ticket machines and you can see pretty much inside I think it's going to be around a month when this opens because we're middle of Feb now and I think this is opening at the end of March or something like that So yeah, definitely close to being open. And it's cool because we followed this from the very, very start to when they started digging it out and when we had those gigantic holes and there was so much sand, just like ginormous piles of sand and just well basically watery holes and now we've got this whole new smart structure there and get another look there at the level sign and we can see there's the level minus one I think I did show you that last week we've got this little grassy hilly bit there I don't know why I ever thought that was steps I mean I need Initially, when I saw this being built, I thought it was going to be steps leading through to a walkway, but it looks like it's just going to be that little grassy hill bit and it's not going to lead to steps at all. So, yeah, it's going to be the same as the other side. Let's just nip onto this bridge. At least the mornings are lighter now. And next Sunday, I'm actually not working in the morning because we have our AGM in the afternoon. Annual general meeting, obviously we all know what that means. And it's kind of a meeting and also a presentation day when we go through the meeting but also all the kids come as well and all the awards are given out and there's a little party and presentation and it's really cool there we can get a much better view off this side of the development now you can pretty much see all the way down there now the view is so much better we'll be able to see the higher level once I get up there 
So yeah, next week, instead of working early morning, I'll be at the meeting from 2 till 6 in the afternoon. But I will try and just come out early to film, dependent on whether or not I can drag my lazy butt out of bed early next Sunday morning. There we go, brilliant view down there and that is pretty much all we can see from this side so now I'm just going to have to get up on the higher level so I shall see you up at the top and just like that we are right back on the higher level so we can see now the top side the higher level of this development so all that is left to do right now is walk around and show you everything from this side so yeah let's go let's walk around here and give you that last view from the front before I end this little video of course we get to look over the old car park as we go and as we already know all this is coming down and I have a feeling they're going to start on that next phase of this development once the car park's open at least I assume they are I mean maybe they'll open the car park in the summer and start on the next phase during the winter I don't know I guess we'll just wait and see and find out together. Looking there, we can get a great side view from there. You can see Central Drive running down there. I don't know if you can see that on the camera, but all the starlings are out. They've been roosting, sleeping, whatever birds do on North Pier for the evening, and now they're heading off to wherever they're going to spend the rest of the day so let's take a look in the front there is our front view the best view so yeah that is it for this video guys once again thank you for watching and if you do enjoy these videos just hit the like button before you go because that'd be really cool if you could do that and maybe even subscribe if you're not already subscribed i have passed 7,000 subscribers now i'm really really happy about that but onwards and upwards we're now heading on towards the next goal which is 8,000 so yeah, long way to go for that one, but we're on the right track. And anyway, for this video, I shall finish it now and I will see you all very soon in the next one. Goodbye.